What up, guys? This is Speckle, and today I got you some Black Ops gameplay, but it's a little different. It's of something I absolutely hate. We're playing Ground War last night and happened to run across some other tool bags. And look what they're doing tack inserting and boosting. Very rarely do I run across boosters in Black Ops, but when I do, man, they're the dumb ones. They're absolutely stupid. These two guys freaking were boosting second chance. At first, one of them wasn't. Uh, Mr. Sergeant Vulture wasn't. And then he leaves the game, comes back with a second chance class. <sighs> Man. These guys were such morons. Um, if you would, please help me get these guys banned. And the way you do that is I'll put their gamer tags in the description. They, um, and I'll say I'm right. Uh, you can see Sergeant Vulture. Uh, SGT space vulture and the other guy looks like burglary but it's actually burgiary he had to use a capital I for the L you see right here I drop down and kill him to piss his little buddy off and <laughs> these weren't e see it even makes it worse whenever they're boosting alright they're boosting alright that's that's whatever that's garbage already and when they're stupid man it makes it even worse. The guy goes right back and puts his tack insert down there again, and I do it to him again. Me and Nepa are going around and killing those guys over and over again. They're just stupid until they decide, well, we're going to go to the other side of the map. So what they do is they go to the uh, back behind A and go try to hide in another bush and do it. And then they go right back to where we're at now. And on top of that, they were boosting second chance I mean oh my god boosting the second chance pro is just garbage alright that stupid perk fortunately you saw today maybe you saw it but uh, there was a post by I think it was Dave Vonderhaar on the Call of Duty forums talking about how they're going to tweak it they're actually going to nerf it and what they're going to do is with second chance they're going to make it to where they're going to try to decrease the invulnerability period of when you're falling. Uh, also, they're going to make it to where with Second Chance Pro, you can only be picked up one time. And they're thinking about increasing the the time it takes for you to be revived. Um, and uh, these, I think they were talking about this like this is things they're thinking about doing that are a good possibility rather than they're going to. But anyways, and another thing they were talking about, something to do with if you put somebody in a second chance, you'll you'll get the full full credit for putting them into it and maybe getting the kill. And maybe the person that kills them while they're in second chance, they get a assist. Uh, that's what I would think it would be if you somebody if you drop somebody in a second chance and they crawl around behind the truck and somebody runs up and kills them, it's going to give them assist and give you the kill, which would be wonderful especially second chance to me is the most annoying when it comes to sniping because a lot of times you'll shoot somebody with a sniper rifle and they'll drop down behind cover because you, that's all you can see of them and you can't get to them and you can't kill them especially with it where they have the railings on a lot of the maps the railings on like balconies and stuff you cannot shoot through no matter what which is something else they need to fix I don't know why they have it but whatever if they can fix it to where they can fix glitches to where you can get inside rocks and you can get outside of maps, they should be able to fix it to where you can shoot through a, uh, a texture model. You know what I mean? And these guys were so stupid. Alright, um, and how to, you don't have to add these guys as friends or nothing like that to report them. And don't report them through uh, Xbox Live because Xbox Live will to jack. You'll have to do it through Treyarch's uh, way of doing it. What you do is, is you find these guys, you go to send them a message, you type in their name, or enter their name, and then you s select private chat, and you send them a private chat invite, and you don't have to actually get in private chat with them or anything like that. And then from there, you can go to the, you can go to view their profile, their gamer card, and then you can go to view COD player card, and when you view their COD player card, you'll be able to see an option to go down and report player 
and report player you select boosting or booster I can't remember which, which one it is but do that and uh, every time I run across guys like these I'm gonna do this from now on because um, Treyarch will ban them people, people are getting reset and uh, I would like that to happen because there is no good excuse for cheating there never is and I don't care what you say there's no way to put it uh, my boosters can suck it video for for Modern Warfare 2 somebody said oh let them live their lives how they want to if boostings where their hearts at let them be that's oh my god I, I, wow that's all I gotta say is wow it's cheating there's no positive way to look at it I'm struggling real hard not to just cuss up a storm right now but anyway please report these guys they're tool bags alright this is Bego peace